Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Uh, today's topic is Williams syndrome. And but before starting, I would like to request you to like, subscribe, and share this video. Thank you. You know, Williams syndrome is a disorder in the development that usually results in learning problems uh, attention deficit disorder anxiety phobias uh, but affected individuals have uh, otherwise they are outgoing personalities you know and the signs and the symptoms of the williams syndrome include like uh, uh, distinct facial features which means uh, a um, broad forehead, short nose with a broad tip, full cheeks, wide mouth with full lips and dental problems. So these are uh, the common signs and symptoms of the Williams syndrome, you know. And, uh, and the people with the Williams syndrome frequently develop uh, aortic stenosis, high blood pressure and uh, other cardiac and uh, connective tissue related problems and uh, hypercalcemia you know now about uh, one in 7500 to 20000 people have this williams syndrome you know and uh, it's caused by deletion of genetic material from the chromosome 7 and the deleted area includes more than 25 genes and not all may be uh, deleted. So the individuals may vary in the amount of genetic material deleted, you know. And uh, the most people uh, do not inherit the Williams syndrome and the deletions in the chromosomes are due to random events that occur in eggs, you know, the sperms from their parents, you know. And this syndrome is uh, autosomal dominant because the only one copy of the altered chromosome 7 can cause this disorder, you know. And uh, the Williams syndrome uh, has many names. For example, uh, Boron syndrome or uh, Elfenfaces syndrome or Elfenfaces uh, with hypercalcemia, hypercalcemia, uh, supravalvar aortic stenosis or infantile hypercalcemia or uh, like uh, uh, supravalvar aortic stenosis syndrome or WBS or William Byrne syndrome or WMS and WS. There are different names which are used for the same medical condition. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease, any medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. Goodbye.